back a long, long time. That if you want to, in a sense, eliminate corruption in a society, and we all want to eliminate corruption in a society, the most effective way to do it is to make sure you don't punish people at the bottom, you punish people at the top. I'll tell you one story. In the, 19, in the 1960s, when Singapore was a very poor country then, our per capita income was 500. A government minister was invited by a businessman to go on holiday. Just a holiday. No bribe. He and his family went on holiday with the businessman. He came back. He was arrested, charged, went to jail. After that, no more corruption. <laughs> because it's very powerful signal that is sent when you go off to someone's the top. So Singapore's experience, and it's actually quite remarkable how you have almost zero corruption in Singapore, is because we decided that the example must come from the top.